Hey, take two. So I'm going to, I just wanted to share how successful, uh, Alfie, flame, good dogs. How successful my walk has been today with Elsa Chops. Um, so Elsa's reactive to people, by the way. She can also be reactive to dogs in some contexts, very rarely, not in the same respect that Henry is. Um, it depends on, on how aroused she is actually. Um, but I found a really awesome way of kind of dealing with that situation, which is to give her this ball. So the ball's super big, they're called jolly balls. I'm not gonna laugh this time uh, in take two. So I think they're called jolly balls or boomer balls maybe even. Um, and it's a small sized one. So she can actually fit the whole thing in her jaws. But because she really likes that um, sensation of clamping down and biting on stuff, um, she really enjoys it. So basically, because she's quite possessive of her toys as well, she will not drop the ball if um, she encounters a person or a dog because she doesn't want to lose it, right? So therefore she can't bark, therefore she can't uh, display much reactive behaviour. And actually she's just enjoying the environment far more. Come on! Just running around and chomping on the ball. Um, I'm not throwing it for her actually. I did when we were down at the water park bit there, um, just to help her to cool off and encourage her to go into the water. Um, but yeah, it's a really cool way of just um, kind of counteracting that kind of behaviour really, of barking or anything like that, have something in her mouth, especially dogs that like to chew down like Elsa does. So yeah, I think they're either called jolly balls or boomer balls, I'm not sure. I'll put it in the description when I go home and check. Um, but yeah, try it out. Hey, have a good day.